How about I say he's a net fly? Bro, he shoots so weird on here, bro. Bro, look, this is I don't can understand that. When have you ever seen that happen in a game? There's a reason we picked San Clemente. We're not in LA, we're not in Miami, we're not in Vegas, because that's just who we are. We're not into the spotlight, we're laid back, we chill, off the way, we go in the gym, get our work done. And the rest of the day, we're do, literally doing nothing. I'm about to go out to Avatar and look at Aston Martin. Just chilling, hanging out, laying low. He wasn't even singing the whole time. Nobody just lounging around, chilling, ain't doing nothing. Everybody kind of has a job, and I always wanted my circle to be the ones that kind of handled most of the stuff for me. But uh, with him being my agent, I was like, everything, is, everything has to go through us. Well, at some point, we always knew, you know, it was kind of gonna happen, but we kind of kicked it off sooner than expected, and I think it's been going, <laughs> it's going extremely well. My name is Reno Dupor. Day to day, whatever De'Aaron needs, gets done. Q, as everybody calls me, I'm uh, De'Aaron's big brother. Kind of try to stay, stay behind the scenes. This is like my first interview, honestly. <laughs> my name is Manuel. Everybody just calls me O. I'm basically just gonna be managing De'Aaron off the court, facilitating things with the firm, with Chris and Reno and uh, the team right now. Agent, agent slash, agent slash. That's that's a good description for us. So we're still doing all the same things we're doing now, but. Now I'm just a certified NBA agent. Oh, you got the flight info? Yeah, they sent me that. I got the email. It's a private plane, right? Private jet. Is it? Yeah. That's why I ain't never heard of that airline. At the end of the day, I think, you know, just, just people closest to you making money together, it's like, why not? Why not do that? Because you going to stop doing cheating? Nah, that's... <laughs> All right, cool. You over here. Guys, you gotta be, we got to be across from each other. Right now. So what you do is, objective of the game is to get four of the same cards in your hand. Ideally, you see how it's a six, mm -hmm. you probably would want to start off with the six. So you pick up the six, you throw down another card that you don't want anymore. So, so you want to pick up the six. Because, because you have a six already. You have a six already. But we can all see each other's cards. No, 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 no. We're, we're, we're going to play like this. You're not allowed to show your teammates your card. So then, say we're done with this, like, say he was going for the king. So then all of these are gone. So yeah, you, and then you flip it. Then you go four more cards back up. If you and Quentin both wanted that five, whoever get that yeah, yeah, first. Yeah. And you got to throw your card out. So you can never have five, you can only have four cards in your hand. In your hand. No, no, the objective of the game now, so I have four nines in my hand. You got to yell peanut butter, which means I got it. Or one of them has to yell jelly, which means if you think that one of us got it. So if you think that I have all four, then you call it jelly. But if, but if, you, if you know your partner got it, then you call then you call peanut butter. butter. All right, so when you get four, you can't call, you can't say, oh, I got it. You well, got how, it. how do I tell my teammate that I got it? That's, so you know, that's, that's, why, that's why I walked out, because you gotta have, you want to have signals. But oh, so like, you can do a bunch of fakes. It. So like, yeah. say, say if I was literally like this. Say I got a. Say I got a. Like, and he like thinks I got I got three nines and a ten. So say he thinks I have a ten. He gonna yeah. I mean, so I'm gonna be like doing fake signals. And he gonna be like, oh, he jelly. got it, jelly. And then I lose. But he yeah. loses because I don't have it. You gotta be fast. Ah, <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> what you gotta do? Uh, <laughs> <that's> <laughs> Yeah, I don't need none of that. Good? I'm good, I'm good. Alright, <laughs> just know the sevens and aces is gone. Don't even. Uh, uh, I don't know what the hell gas pulling, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jelly. 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 And he's so competitive that he's not gonna let you forever beat him. This man literally got on YouTube and learned how to like dominate the first eight moves. He learns how to control the board now. So I was like, I, I created a monster, I guess, with the chess thing. Cause I was killing him and now I can't beat him right now. He got triggers on it there. Okay, for one, like I said, the only thing that I use the scuff controller for, I use these for Call of Duty. What does that do? I use them for Call of <laughs> Here, hold on. <laughs> chill, chill. Here, bro, no. Nah. Y'all be. Chill, bro. Niggas be, you gotta check his controller. Okay, here. It's just for Call of Duty, so I don't have to take my. I don't have to take my hand off of 
off of these. I can just use, so it'll be X square triangle circle. I use it for Call of Duty though. Look, look. No, it's not called cheating, it's called I can afford it. I play on broadcast. But I beat him on the 2K camera view. Different, right? All right, wait, time out, time out, time out. Did I beat you on your camera? Different. Did I beat you on 2K? Different. It's crazy. It's crazy. I don't play shot either. I don't play shot either. But I just time out. Like, I watch basketball. How about that? You Oh, you watch basketball? What camera they play when you watch basketball? They don't matter. Shut up. <laughs> bro, what you want the height? Hey, hey, what you want the height sit on? Bro, come on, man. Bro, bro what you want? Bro, that's perfect. It's perfect. That's perfect. Y'all hear that, right? The camera is perfect. Let me see that five. Nah, we good. Go hold up, hold up. What you need, bro? Hold on. We good. Bro, you, you need it higher. You need, wait, you, you like 2K low? Like, bro, what you want? Nah, nah, regular 2K. Right. Cool. Bro, he shoots so weird on him. Bro, look, this is, I don't fing understand that. When have you ever seen that shit happen in a game? So, no matter what it is, we could be flipping a bottle. We're gonna try and see who flipped the bottle first. The best. It's like, it's just something about us, I guess. Bro, you trash, bro. You trash, bro. This man is trash. And he do nothing. Yeah, bro, you trash. Hey, what camera we played on? Hey, what camera we played on, bro? Up, we played on 2K? Oh, Alone in summer? I ain't playing this shit no more. Yes, you are, bro. Yeah, sure. Okay. He's not always an agent. Where other people, that's always your agent. Doesn't. Uh, I think like the relationship is a lot different than other ones. Chick fil A fries. You don't like them? Yes. And <laughs> oh. how you put canes over Chick fil A? Thank you. I'm just thinking about fries right now. Chick-fil-A, <laughs> McDonald's fries. Who you think got the best fries? Checkers rallies. What about Wingstop? They put sugar on it. They ain't cheap. What about Burger King tacos? What the? What? what? Hey, yeah. You ain't seen the commercials yet? Who would go to Burger King and eat tacos, man? It's a cold commercial. I mean, yeah. people want to eat burgers. Yeah. Yeah. burgers. Yeah. Oh, I want to change the way this business looks, you know? There's not a lot of young black men that's agents in this business. I want to show guys, young NBA players, that you can hire someone that looks like you. It's okay. Like it's 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 not the world is not going to end as long as that person is trusted, educated. It's okay to empower the, the people that's around. And you. The, but the Bentley though, the Bentley is cool, but not everybody like know what a Bentley is. That boy, you pull up in something like an Aston, you don't even have to know what it is. Just look nasty. Yeah, that boy Gas pulled up in the, in the Rolls Royce. He said, I should not pose. Cause he was trying to take a picture with it for the ground. Oh my God, Gas, <laughs> yeah, you make you mad. Hey, nah, this was, like, this, was like this was like a year ago. This was last summer. Like, this was last summer. He's like, should I open both doors? How do I sit in it? Yeah, I can't yeah, even think straight, man. That shit was. <laughs> yeah, that, that double. How much arm. is how much is the? I should have took you a little. How much the Aston? Which one? Yeah. You know, you do this with the little hair rest on the arm. Let me see if you see that. Oh, I know. I mean, a lot of, of course, is gonna have to do with, you know, what I do on the court, with how strong this will be. All those guys you see them, they're still in the gym with me, you know, helping me get better. So, um, it's definitely a collective group, but I think it definitely starts with, you know, kind of what I do on the court. So, a lot of older agents, they were trying to use that against me, saying, oh, he's just a trainer, he doesn't know what he's doing, but I see it as an advantage. I see it as a weapon, like, I'm on the floor with these guys. I had a relationship with these guys. So NBA teams and general managers, they enjoy talking to me. A lot of these guys who are agents never picked up a basketball day in their life. I don't know no other agency or group that's doing that with their players. You know? So I think it's something that's unique and it's, and it's special. And I know this is going to be a huge, a huge thing. He made a gigantic leap from year one to year two. So now, we're looking at becoming a, a franchise, a superstar, all-star, a max contract, super max contract type player. That's the goal. Like you said, to go from averaging 17 to 22, 23, 24 points a game. And that's just a matter of uh, getting more volume on three ball attempts, uh, becoming more efficient from the free throw line, just being more aggressive. And so that's just the mindset. I mean, it's nothing fancy. We're just going to get in the gym and get reps, reps. Reps, reps, reps. I mean, just every day, consistent, every single day. I mean, just continue to get better. I mean, I want to make an all-defensive team, be an all-star, of course, and uh, for us to get to the playoffs, I mean, I feel like if I can achieve my personal goals, then I feel like that makes us a better team.